Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel, your technical friend. Today I am going to explain how to disassemble Lenovo G5080 for doing uh, for cleaning uh, fan and motherboard. First of all, you need to open the battery and one more lid is there, base panel lid. Okay, you need to remove the three screws are there. You need to remove the screws. You need to open this lid one base panel lid. Again, you need to remove the hard disk. Four screws are there for hard disk. You need to remove that screws. Okay, pull the hard disk backward. You can remove the hard disk. Then you need to remove this one SDD, ODD, sorry, DVD right off. Pull that one also. It will came out. Again, what are the screws are there in base panel? You remove the whole screws. This is I am doing for it exhaust more it. I need to apply the cooling paste, a cooling paste, and to clean the fan. I am going to remove the each and every screws. You need to be careful while removing screws and everything. If you want, you can. Uh, do a RAM upgrade also by seeing this video then you need to remove the cooling fan You need to remove the fan connector. You need to remove the this one Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi card, and Wi-Fi antenna wires are there. You need to okay, do carefully. If anything happened to that Wi-Fi cables, antenna cables, the Wi-Fi will not catch properly. Remove the Wi-Fi cord. And what are the keyboard screws are there? Remove the display connector and DC jack connector. Check the screws if you have any screws are left. Open the lid, remove the keyboard. And open the connector of this one keyboard. Touch card connector is there. You need to remove carefully. Again, okay. Open the okay palm rest. Our keyboard panel.
friends do carefully by removing this one because so many this one locks are there if locks are broken it won't sit properly again See friends, <coughs> to remove the motherboard, so many st strips are there, okay, data board strips and ODD strip. And one more speaker connector is there. To remove the motherboard, three screws are attached to the base panel, you need to remove that screws also. Friends, you can do general service by yourself by seeing this video for Lenovo G5070 for almost each and every laptop same procedures are there but you need to see you need to do carefully because some models are so many models are different and the architecture is also different and the build of each and every parts is also base panel including everything will be different different you can uh, remove like this again I am going to remove the heat sink of this one processor be careful friends friends the cooling paste become okay, very hard it was like a liquid type now it's become very hard it's become a solid i'm going to remove that that whole paste i am removing this whole paste also for to apply new paste now I applied the ok cooling paste again I am going to ok fit the heat sink for to the processor the what are the exact sky screw, screws are there you need to put that screws only because if you put extra large or length screws it will damage to the motherboard you need to careful in while okay tightening the screws I am going to clean the, this one also cooling fan by using brush see friends now I am doing assembling the uh, assembling the whole thing what I have removed in uh, Lenovo G5080 again I am going to do assemble if you want you can 
see the assembly in this one in this video also in same video see friends you need to put the connector carefully if you didn't put it won't catch the ok connections See friends, now I am going to put the motherboard screws. I am going to assemble the keyboard panel and press this properly to lock that one you need to careful while pressing the locks See friends, now I am going to give it this one keyboard also. Need to fix the locks and each and everything. Okay, now I am going to put the screws of the best panel. keyboard screws are there I am going to fix each and everything if you fix the screws all screws it will very helpful to the laptop also it will give and support to the body of the motherboard I am going to attach the DC job connector and display cable you need to fix that properly you need to check that if it is locked lock as done properly or not now i am doing wi-fi card attaching attaching to that uh, connector wi-fi connector if any app scratches or anything's happened to the okay wi-fi cables the wi-fi signals are not going to catch properly see friends and you need to fix the antenna cable also otherwise there will be a sticker for that one each cable you need to saw that one One is main and another one is ox. Ox are fixed or not. Again I am going to fix the okay this one cooling fan. I am tightening the cooling fan by screws. I am going to attach the DVD writer in this way you can do service of Lenovo G5070 by yourself almost G5070, G5080 almost equal models some little bit difference is there you can do 
okay service for cooling fan service and ram upgrade or hdd replacement keyboard replacement you can see you can done by yourself by seeing this video oh, okay friends see friends now i am going to okay put the hard disk again to in that position hard disk position how would hdd connect to i am going to tighten the screws for the hard disk need to do the general service by yourself by seeing this video finally okay fix the back base panel lid lock on there you need to put properly Three screws are there. Finally, you attach the battery. Lock the battery. After completion, once you check the okay laptop, I'm going to turn it on to check out the laptop. It's turned on. By seeing this video, you can do general service of Lenovo laptops. friends if you are not subscribe my channel please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for next upcoming videos thank you for watching